The more question here, I say, twenty sixth of November. Sir, I will lose you. No, me, but uh, uh, so that it is not lost. Mm -hmm. Twenty uh, sixth of November before mm -hmm. seventh uh, December. December, mm -hmm. which means that by extension, mm -hmm. it could be six December. December, it could even be seven December. December itself. Ah, try what to happen? What to happen? Then we announce eight and ninth, tenth. Mm -hmm. What to happen? Because because because, because mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the sovereign will of the people. Mm -hmm. As I mentioned, mm -hmm. yeah. the sovereign will of the people mm -hmm. takes prominence. Mm -hmm. So you have called by. Atikuba JSC, as it then was. As we mentioned, now it's here. As it then says, let's not go back to the ninth. Ninth. Eh? Uh -huh. The ninth, as per their own uh, decisions, some decisions no. in the Supreme Court. As it then called by our because substantively, eh? mm -hmm. the matter was conclusive. Conclusive because he received it on 26 November. Mm. In the 26 November, then you can extend it uh, to even 7th December. You get the point I'm making? Sure, sure. Uh -huh. The 7th December, I had to have an answer certificate. No, still, it was conclusive. And therefore, his uh, qualification uh, had no issues. I'm saying that by further extension, the sovereign will of the people supersedes everything. I will tell you. Okay, I will take, mm. take over. Take over. Okay, fine. Uh, Nana, <laughs> uh, this whole thing, eh? Mm. Oh, yeah, I took over the GSC Nazama. Oh, yeah, extra territorial NDC agenda. Arrange. I will tell you. Tell me. Me pese me tie. Say, Mama, that one there. Oh, yeah, extra territorial NDC agenda. Matrato on the first. Now prove me. Now some more can. Or in the maybe. More in. One about uh, critiquing the the decision of the Supreme Court. Supreme Court, Court uh, yeah. On the articulation. That's mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. The other one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Since you are occur retirement. Mm -hmm. When would they? Appointment of, of justices. justices. Yeah. In one mm -hmm. For them to have the real independence. Those are his words. Yes. Real independence. Mm hmm uh the, those appointments must be done by a body very independent yeah ma'am independent body as mm -hmm. uh, on yeah based on uh protocol uh, judicial uh, uh, yeah, yeah, political uh, president, uh, uh, on yeah on those lines if I, for the avoidance of doubt quote for us appointments to the judiciary or mm -hmm. any other governance institution must be made by thoroughly independent bodies mm -hmm. based on nothing but merit and not on things like protocol, chronism, ethnicity, or other improper considerations. Uh, body. <laughs> That's what he wants to tell us. The governance institutions, particularly, <laughs> must be, um, particularly the judiciary, like, must be realistically no, 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 insulated. Merit, and not by appointment. Must be realistically insulated against presidential and other political pressures. Service conditions must be reasonably attractive. And security of tenure of office must be enshrined. <laughs> the executive powers of the president and his functionaries must be drastically curtailed <laughs> there must be a real separation of parliament from the executive branch the emphasis should be on good and sincere governors in the interest of the people and not on hollow over exaggerated notions of electoral conferment of power on anybody or a group of people wow but no meaningful political reforms can be reasonably expected even under a regime change without sustaining the political renaissance which has started and is growing well in ghana now let me say extraterritorial ndc agenda i i just is mm -hmm. he's able to see this only after exiting the judiciary Sir, the question I am posing mm -hmm. uh, is that the real independence uh, 
the real suppression of powers mm -hmm. and the security of tenure of judges. Mm -hmm. You are seeing this only after leaving the Supreme Court that whilst you were in active service you didn't see those and who tells you that if you saw them whilst in active service you couldn't have said them and now is that the two one eh today professor from Pong Barton when I am a member of government all is well as a major when I am out in the last two and a half years or so, it is the worst government we have ever had because I'm not part. Now, in order that I don't lose the major legs that I've set down, I say, I say, I say, I say, I say, I say, I as a military, in the third one, he called for commendations, certain bodies and individuals. That's a show one. Individual bodies and individuals now less one now. Oh, boom, how bad? Oh, why win one? You should not be left in doubt that this is extraterritorial NDC agenda. Mamufa, you have a question. Okay, over what you but just a second. Oh, ah, okay, just a second. I don't guys my trial. And Jimmy, it's too many what we say, but I also, it's so brother. He added, <laughs> it should be noticed. Oh, the <laughs> measure, <laughs> <laughs> so okay, to you. Yeah. He added, it should be noticed that uh, Mr. Ajay Kwesi uh, 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 his certificate of citizenship is tied to an oath of allegiance. The two move together. It is difficult to think that Jachi Kwesi who submitted his renunciation of citizenship papers to Canada in 2019 could still in December 2020 be held as seriously owing allegiance uh, to as a matter of hard realism <laughs> as opposed to formalism to Canada. Justice Atuguba expressed concern over independence and impartiality of the judiciary and questioned why the constitution empowered the president to appoint four representatives of the judiciary uh, judicial council aside the attorney general executive powers of the president and functionalities must be curtailed <laughs> he said is it uh nana angle the first point in there hard realism as opposed to formalism yeah man that's where he's placing his emphasis Pachawain. and that the hard realism uh -huh. on it uh, before the elections, fact, which was uh, 26 November, uh, the man had received his certificate. Or he had written, no, no. For, mm. he got a certificate before, yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's 26 November, November yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But Constitution, baby, ma, oche, yeah, opening of nominations. Uh -huh. One in the eligibility criteria, opening of nomination at the electoral commission. And the electoral commission. And the party nominations. No, 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 no. I mean, uh, you are not. in charge of completely uh, irrelevant here, because there are national matter and national elections. And see, on your party level, and see, hard realism against uh, formalism. Nana, he he was part of the decision in the Republic, and. The High Court General Jurisdiction Expert, Dr. Esnato Rollins, Interested Party, Ni Ama Ashite. Mosi mm Yede, -hmm. Party Ko Primish, Ni Wukayi, Oye, Dr. Zenato. Abra Woyinin, Ena, Oye, registered voter. Nana Zomiche. Uh -huh. I am a registered voter. Now, in part, no, a member of parliament. Yeah, ni ama ashite. In the other prime minister, Olusi. In the Olusi, what to happen with? No court. 
Kwa kwa tenzu kwa daa kwa tide. Pe arrangement haa. Owa wan. Owa de. Oye nyimpa wei jinin. Oye registered voter. Nti. Oye registered voter nti. Oye disqualified. Uh -huh. Nti. Kwa ten. Dam. Abana watu enu. Ombongu. High court. Before our back, I summon a Zanatone counsel, no lawyer. Kade, the matter was premature. In the high court, in Monte Cra, because its resolution had not been properly invoked because the matter was premature. High court in Bo Zanatone judge and eh, 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 lawyer, lawyer Nasamo Torchini. No more call, Supreme Court. What cross Supreme Court? Then, uh, there was one question which fell for determination. On there, when can it be properly said that a Ghanaian citizen is by reason of non-registration as a voter not qualified? When? When? Not qualified to be a member of parliament within Article 941A of the 1992 Constitution of Ghana. This decision was about a non-registered voter. Ma judge question now the question here. I think ninety four two. Owing allegiance. Allegiance, yeah. Now there is an earlier decision here. Professor Gokwasi, Okro Court. Ah, two government also deliver the judgment. Ah, on link allegiance to citizenship. The in Tumunka. Citizenship. I think the a citizen does not owe allegiance. In fact, citizenship is bound with allegiance. I took by no turn the matter to or deliver judgment on that matter. And see, citing those authorities, and even with this one, oh yeah, my NDC, Doctor Zenato the Crocotti, even though. On yet precisely the matter which was for determination, so precisely what the court determined. But court in Kabibi, Nana eligibility criterion, court in a year, more do you know, she has more cause. Consequently, it is our view that the eligibility criteria set out in Article 94.1, na I eligibility, even though 94.1. Then you go to 94.2. Those are criteria which have been set down. But you cannot say there. It is applicable in, say, 94.1 and not applicable in 94.2. Or say, your eligibility. The person must fulfill them in order to be eligible. And see, burning JSC. What's the consequently, it is our view that the eligibility criteria set out in Article 94.1a come into force only when a public election of a member of parliament has been declared by the electoral commission and it has set the time to file nominations thus a person who qualifies to enter parliament must be a Ghanaian citizen must be a Ghanaian citizen of 21 years or beyond and a registered voter as at the date as at the date he files his nomination papers within the time stipulated by the Electoral Commission for that particular election. That is the true interment of that article. He was part of the majority decision. The dissenting voice was saying, in your boy, JSC. The, sir, ebaji, watum, the, idzimu, pi, ah, yebotum, I'm a quaint major ya to witty da ba make a general dam and pesso do bra. Now the men the me a bra electoral commission a boy nominations. That is the time all that the madina if I fail. That's a question that is not contentious. He himself by the facts yet are urgent to me there as of 9th October 2020. In any renunciation of Canadian citizenship, and no, mate. Oh, mate. Oh, mate. 
So you pay your nagging, a your personal intention. Then my pray may dam, not the old mu or stupider and pa what intention now it's been actuated. Why be ma on your mother one back home? My mother was a bad it was home. Oh no, the Supreme Court. What you know? What the cadre? Man she shan at him. O be all be all work on a ha. Opera what to do about more commercial gum. A bra electoral commission over one nominations. The Mabrin, no other would see who sound there and pa. A suffata, no other what to do to Daba. Now the Mabrina electoral commission or the motor twenty. Now that you question on sea. On no one work, no say. It was a choice between hard realism and one better no formalism. Your hard realism. That is what, by opinion, the opinion of the majority or of the, the court was that that was the way to go. That was the decision. And that is the decision. That is the law. That is the law. Oh, we pray that oh, is the yes substantive. On yes, oh, here be a, in the second 26 in it, to add one more coin, then 27, then 28, then 29, into December. How do you make law so 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 amorphous? <coughs> eh? You make the law so amorphous. You are unable to put a determinative end. And I'm saying that. Mm -hmm. I'm saying that the sovereign will of the people. Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. I mean, the power resides in the, in the the sovereignty of Ghana resides in the people. Mm -hmm. And so, I'm not even if even if he is not. By Article 94, mm -hmm. on your eligible, nine year on your car. That is the sovereign will of the people. people. That is what we must respect. It is, after 17 crown point, it is the sovereign will, will of the people. But that is not how law must work. Sovereign will of the people it must not operate under uncertainty. In the brain, as she said, separate to an amount the man. Answer now, you bad you want to me. The mibili. Oh, there, the magic. It's it. More cunning now. But, no, no, that is first leg. Mr. Obey. No, that's the first leg. No, the other two. I don't know. You, you have enough time. Oh, okay, two minutes. Yes, two minutes. Two minutes. Yes, yes. Two minutes strictly. But, yes. but, okay. but, 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 at that point, he raises on it there real separation, mm -hmm. security of tenure. Constitution guarantees that. Look, nobody has power, nobody, unless a judge renders himself to the circumstances which will lead to his removal, removal. unless he, the judge himself. On a so, I a constitution a watcher. I da judge by ya. On do move you. But otherwise, a judge has security of tenure guaranteed, black and white, in the 1992 constitution. It is when Justice Atukuba mm -hmm. comes to the public to say real independence. What does he mean? Is he telling us? That whilst he sat on the court, on the bench, he was, was no not independent. independent. He did not have independent mind as a judge. Was there anything pulling. anywhere? Pulling, pulling. Was there anything like that? Mm -hmm. oh, see, I, I tell you, I'm showing that there is one common agenda B. And that agenda, I don't know the there, extraterritorial NDC agenda. That more. I was a perennial uh, flag bearer. I was not there. Oh, yeah, judiciary. There's a problem. There's an issue. And see, it is all to add to it. No, no. It is all to add to it. Otherwise, that very institutional, it's not that. I don't take care. I see you will see your last. Now you see your last. You see your real size. You see your real size. Not your last. Your real size. Ah, okay, fine. Your real size. So People don't like tell you. 
So those times, Atuguba could indeed marshal the power of the judiciary, the power conferred on them to do what he could do, to sentence people uh, for contempt. Today, after leaving the place, there is no real independence. It is all to add to that and we'll the Martin, then, oh, that, but last that week, me, oh, that, no, no. Me, my two minutes, no, but no, I'm in Professor, I'm in Why miss the form? Why miss miss form? He does this and then makes a tall list of individuals. You know, have you seen those individuals? I have. Uh huh. Individuals are, are the baby today. They are hills, heads over hills, uh, in competition with one another to uh, criticize this government, to bastardize this government, to make wild allegations and all kinds of things. He has listed all of them and commanded them and urged, urged them to continue. So you see that extraterritorial NDC agenda. Martin.